One UI 8 Beta 2 is here, and it's all about smooth performance, smart fixes, and small but important improvements. If you're testing it on your Galaxy S25, you're going to love this update. Let's break it down in simple terms. Samsung just dropped the One UI 8 Beta 2 update for the Galaxy S25 series with the build number ZYF3. It's based on Android 16, and the update size is around 1,204 megabytes. You'll also get the June 2025 security patch, which keeps your phone safe with the latest protections. There's a cool new feature in the Interpreter app. You can now send feedback directly to Samsung, helping them improve how well the Interpreter works in future updates. Bug fixes and improvements. Let's go over the main fixes in Beta 2. Now brief text fix. The text now aligns properly, and the morning briefing screen doesn't hang around longer than it should. Battery widget and lock screen. Battery icon visibility is improved. Fix the bug where widgets on the lock screen would randomly grow bigger. Fingerprint unlock. Fingerprint issues are fixed. Unlocking your phone is now faster and more reliable. Secure folder and Bluetooth calls. You can now move files in secure folder without issues. The Bluetooth call volume drop problem, especially in cars, is fixed. Notifications in games. Notification sounds now work properly during gaming, so no more silent alerts. Galaxy AI and navigation gestures. AI wallpapers for weather and time now load correctly. You can go back using gestures without it bugging out. S Pen for S25 Ultra. The air command icon doesn't vanish anymore when you pull out the S Pen. Clock app alarm bug. Alarms now ring even if the clock app wasn't updated after installing the beta. App updates and system stability. Samsung also improved several apps behind the scenes, especially the Cock Camera app, to boost performance, reduce crashes, and make everything smoother overall. Availability. Beta 2 is now rolling out in Germany, India, Poland, South Korea, the UK, and the US. If you're in the beta program, go to Settings, Software Update, Download and install to grab the new version.